Welcome to Cooking with E and T. Cooking with T and E. What's happening? What's up? What's up? What's up? We are so mad with this good lasagna. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, today we are having a veggie lasagna. I'm really happy that you did this. Really? Yeah, for my job, they did something like this, and I want to see how you versus my job. It's doing and with the way it smell, it smells delish. Can you tell me the ingredients what you put in? Yes, I will. Let me let the people see it. And then he cut up all the little I had onions on top. I love, I love onions. onions. <laughs> onions is the bomb. Boom boom. Dot com. What I did was eggplants. I did squash and I did zucchini and I did um, portobello mushrooms and I did bell peppers and garlic inside the sauce. Now, all of the only thing that went in sauce was bell pepper, onion, garlic inside the sauce, and I made my own base to build up the sauce. Mm. So I like to do my own. Very mm. interesting. As I you do. can see, mine's a little bit different. I have a thing for ranch on lasagna. He like that white stuff. It's black. <laughs> I will say it's black. Thing. You get up <laughs> on that white stuff. Mm -mm 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 -mm. <laughs> and up on your backstroke. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell the girl no more. Now you in the house. Pepper Lord. <laughs> but so I really, really like really, 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 really. And then I did this. slivers of onions in between that little green onion stuck up in there because I'm an onion queen, baby. All the different, different, different tastes of so it. So Good. They do. Look at it. Look at it. If y'all can see how pretty it is. It is. And I like sauce. I like to build my sauce. I don't just throw my sauce. And it's mushrooms in here. You know what? What? I didn't start thinking about building my sauce until I met you. Build the sauce. Don't build the meat. Build the sauce. When I met you, how many years have been now? About two, three. About two, three. When I met you, you used to, you used to talk about building the sauce. No, like it's from like, um, what is it, um, mm -hmm. what's, what, what's the name of, um, uh, that's good. Um, uh, regano, is it ragu, ragu? Ragu? Or, or I did not use ragu. Ragu or the other guy, there's a man on, 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 on the face of his, uh, product. I can't think of Well, it's name. Paul Newman. I think that's it. Paul Newman. He got a great sauce. He has a great sauce. So no I use that. But mm -hmm. when I met you, mm -hmm. one day, and this is, this is, I just got you, but you know, I, I love you. Because um, I was in, I was at um, the dollar store. Mm -hmm. And at that time, I was, you know, trying to make ends meet, trying to make, you know, make you sure, to. trying to make things, that, you know, in me. Mm -hmm. And so I ran across just tomato paste mm -hmm. and, some, and some tomato sauce. Mm -hmm. So I got that, and I actually started putting in my, my, Time, my oregano, mm -hmm. uh, my thyme, my oregano, so even a little, little, a little dash of lemon pepper. I put in uh, some salt and pepper, um, some basil, and mm -hmm. I put all this stuff together. Mm -hmm. And I actually made my for the first time, and I did not get the expiration until you said something about it. That's when I actually built my own sauce. Real sauce. And when I did it, when I did it, it felt like it was seasoning uh, me, but yeah. build your sauce. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I built myself and it was so good. Mm -hmm. It was so good. So like it was like why pay two, three dollars for the other one? Rugu or mm -hmm. Rugu, whatever it is. Mm -hmm. When I could just pay a dollar, mm -hmm. get my paste and get my sauce, get it, put it together, and season that sauce, and season, season that sauce, and make my own. Put the bell pepper, the onion, the garlic, the onion, the garlic, whatever you feel. Time, time all that in there. Build your sauce. And you feel so much better when you do it yourself. Mm-hmm. It yeah. tastes so much better. Yeah. Because what I do is I sit there and I just let it saute and get it down. And I don't I do not drain the water off of it. I let the water go into the sauce. You don't drain the water off the off the the, the vegetables. Oh you done? Mm-mm. I leave it in there because that's the flavor that's building off of that. So once you add the sauce, then normally when you do it, you put it inside the meat and then you drain all that flavor out. So don't put it in meat, put it in the sauce. 
And then when you add your tomatoes and all of that into the, your your tomato paste or whatever you use to bill it, that's where you bill in the sauce wrong. Don't pull that don't pull that board off. You know what I did for the first time? What you did? I you ever had a couscous? I love couscous. I don't know how to cook it though. Yeah. It's, it's couscous you can get all in the uh, pre made we add a little small little balls. <laughs> I they they are. They, <laughs> I saw them today. Goo goo. Mm -hmm. You know what I did? What you did? I got some um couscous and I got it and I made it you know, I, I already cooked it. When I cooked it, I got it and wrapped it in some uh a, a plastic bag, like you put like a sandwich in or something. Mm -hmm. I got it and I, and I just put it in that. Mm-hmm. So when I put it in the microwave, I just throw it in the microwave, get it hot when I want it. So anyway, mm -hmm. I got some pesto. Mm -hmm. right? I love so pesto. I love pesto. I love pesto. I love pesto. Baby. Pesto, pesto is the bond.com. Believe that. Hmm. I got that. And so I got a, a, a little bed, of, a little a coating at the bottom of a bowl. Or, um, uh, what do you call it? A stainless steel bowl. Mm -hmm. Cover the bottom. I got the pesto and I put it in there. So on the side, I got some salt and pepper and lemon, salt and pepper and lemon pepper. I, I love zestiness. Mm -hmm, me too. I love zestiness, and mm -hmm. lemon pepper has a zest, a zesty too. That's not my favorite. I know it's that's not your favorite. favorite. It's not, not your favorite. favorite zest. But what mm -hmm. I did, I got um, three types of uh, three three different types of peppers: a green, and a yellow, and a red, and I got um, the orange. Mm -hmm. Mix those together. I got some um, purple onion. I love purple onion. I love it because it has a sweet and not overbearing. I love purple I got that. onion. So I decided to just chop it all up. Mm -hmm. I chopped it up as, as fine as I can get it. Mm -hmm. So I decided, you know what? What else would bring this dish out? And I thought about mushrooms. I got mm -hmm. some mushrooms. Got that. Chopped it up with it. Mm -hmm. And I throw it in there with the couscous. Mm -hmm. And I mix it all up with the pesto. Mm -hmm. So now I'm mixing it. Now I'm thinking about what is gonna bring my my couscous out? Mm -hmm. So I got some pepper. I got some couscous. Oh, my bad. I'm sure you okay. got some couscous. I'm sure you did. <laughs> Man, all the world. <laughs> What's a couscous? I right couldn't now? help myself. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. Hey, look, oh, it's a couscous and your war eagle. <laughs> and it's sore. War eagle. Oh, Lord. War eagle. Eagle all day. And a heel. So mm -hmm. I got that, mm -hmm. got some salt and pepper on my, on my couscous because I want it. What I'm gonna bring about my couscous? I want my I don't want my couscous to be bland mm -hmm. while my my vegetables are being seasoned. I want my couscous to be bland. So I got some salt and pepper because I just want to bring it out back. Mm -hmm. So I got pesto, mm -hmm. salt and pepper on the couscous. Mm -hmm. Then I got the, my variety of vegetables with the mushrooms, the different type of peppers, and the onions. I got that. I put blended all together. And so I was thinking, Italian. What do what type of meat do I want to do? What what type of so I thought about it and I got some chicken breast when I slice it on the side mm -hmm. like that chicken Ooh, breast yeah. when I slice mm -hmm. it when I put it on the grill I put some um, Creole seasoning mm -hmm. to give it a little kick because I like I like kick so mm -hmm. I give it a little That's kick what's in and so I give it a little kick and then after that I got my marinara sauce mm -hmm. on marinara and on a marinara on this particular marinara I did. A, a little bit of dash of onion and, and stuff like just to get you know, more basil, oh, more more basil, more mm -hmm. uh, oregano stuff like that. You know, Italian season, and I just get that I got that marinara together. Mm -hmm. So I got my chicken, and I tossed the chicken in the marinara. So I'm tossing, I'm tossing, I'm tossing. I said, oh, I'm tossing. Come on, come on, I'm tossing. A war eagle, a war eagle, a war eagle. Toss, what? what? What 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 eagle what eagle sauce? What eagle sauce? When you do a war eagle style, they always come out good. The war eagle be cooked from the heart, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got we got that. We know what we got the what the eye of the tiger. Yeah, yeah. We got the eye of the tiger. So I got the couscous. I did. I got my plate, and I wanted to put it a walk like this. I wanted to go up because I wanted to be a. Like a bowl, a bowl, but not a bowl, but like a ship, like a ship style. And I want to create it up. And so when I got my couscous, like I said last time, beat it up. There are, there are couscous in the house tonight with irons. Stand up, the bell, but 
the way I did, I built, I put it in the middle, mm -hmm. and I always wipe my plate because I want my, I want my presentation to look good. Mm -hmm. So I wipe my plate and put it in the circle. Mm -hmm. As I build it up, I got the chicken. Mm -hmm. As I put the cream on it, toss it in the marinara. I got it and I put it on top. Mm -hmm. When I put it on top, I got some, some fresh parsley, chopped it up. And just like these onions that we have right here, I got that and I like slanting them. Mm -hmm. I like presentation. Presenta yeah, presentation, presentation is everything. Is everything. So I got that in the parts and I got it and I, and I put it on top. And I actually have a picture of that. I don't know if you guys can see it on this park cross. But, uh -huh. but I have a ending. I have a matter of fact, this is it right here. This is it. I garnished it with a little. I don't know if you, can, you guys can see it. Probably can't. Let's see. Um, Let me look up. So, Did you make a bed? This is it. This is the goose goose. Okay. This is the onion. The oh, that looks good. I got a marinara sauce. So throw it on yeah. top. Yeah. So I was thinking Italian, and so I got some Parmesan cheese, and I just I just sprinkle across the top. Get in I got my green onions and my, 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 uh, my green onions and my parsley. I throw it on top. Mm -hmm. And uh, I fed it to the maintenance guy, and one of the guys that worked there, and he because they, they well, what it was, they have been um, want to see what I do every day mm -hmm. to try to eat a little bit healthier. Mm -hmm. And I also, and these are all health, health, uh, health, health benefits. Girl, I'm gonna call you back. I'm feeling child. It be that way sometimes. Okay. It be the way. But the health benefits. So you get this. Your couscous, couscous, couscous is a start. Couscous is very good. But I just don't know how to cook it. It's like so tiny. It really is. It's just so it's tiny. It's more a boiling, a boiling thing. And, and you know, if you go like somewhere in Italy, they're going like to actually hand make it. So mm -hmm. imagine doing all those little beads hand made. I'm winning. I wouldn't. I wouldn't imagine and I wouldn't want to. No man, no hand. There's enough to cut up these vegetables to make stuff that it tastes Amen. good. Well, I did. Uh, um, that looked good. But, but the far Can we lighten that up? I hope we, I hope we Let can. Let me see. Can y'all see that? I don't know I don't if y'all can. Not, I'm gonna take it in. Let's see what it is. I'm gonna get up a little bit. Oh, y'all might can see that then. Let me straighten Probably that can. up. Yeah. He makes a lot of dishes, and maybe he needs to start showing that a little bit more. Uh, you can follow what him on his um, Facebook page, and then we could just give that out. Of yeah. what um, I do what he I do. do. I do what I'm, all I do. Because he cook a lot more at work than he will here because of the hours that he work. He really listen. He really work a lot what of I hours. Work. But on my Facebook page, you can see all the dishes that I cook, all the things that I create. Everything is done from the heart. And I love cooking from the heart because when you cook from the heart, people receive your food a lot better. Exactly. And not only that, God is 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 a um a down I call it download. It's a download from God of the of the, all these dishes that I cook. But on this dish, uh, the health benefits is like if, if you're gonna do cheese, you're gonna garnish your food. You do cheese, do um, parmesan. White cheese is better for you than mm. than the, the uh, cheddar cheese. The yellow cheese it it, it has a lot of um. It messes with oil. my oil, mm -hmm. it messes with my sinuses, mm -hmm. you know, it, 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 it's a mucus, it builds mucus in your body. I like and, the Mexican mixture of cheese. Oh yeah, I like that, I like that, 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 um, mm -hmm. that blend. Um, and then you're doing uh, the, 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 all the peppers well. and stuff, you got all your, uh, your peppers and your onions, you get so many mm -hmm. vitamins and so many nutrients from the peppers, the peppers and stuff that you're using. So I try to use a lot of that, so I have people now come to me and say, hey, Tony, can you tell me? Look, I'm I'm working out, but I want to have some starch to have energy, but I also want to have some vegetables there to keep me going through the day. So now people are coming to me and want to know the, the nutritional value of the stuff that I cook, mm -hmm. and I'm and I'm te and I'm teaching them, mm -hmm. and, I, and I'm I'm good about that. I'm, I feel good about this. So anyway, I created that dish, and everybody was happy about it. I'm happy about it. And it's, it's, every day is a different dish. So anyway, brainstorming people out there. If you um, all you gotta do is brainstorm. If you're a cook, whoever you are, brainstorm. Put your just just, just get yourself together. You know, sometimes God just just download stuff to you. It just it just brainstorm. So I try to be a, a, a nutritional cook. It be the way sometimes, and I know um this right here it has starch. What you need in the morning for the begin to begin your day. Starch helps you get to your day, but you want to do it at the beginning of the day. At the end of the night, if you do it in the, the night, it's gonna build up in your stomach. It's gonna become sugar. 
Like when it comes to sugar, do you have a belly like mine? Because I love fault. beer. I love beer. I'm so sorry, America. I love it's beer. It's not your fault. It's not just, whoa, 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 it ain't your fault. It, I, I cooked early today, so this is a annoying conversation to me. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. On that part. On that part on the time. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Y'all gotta forgive me. Sometimes I get so much into my food. I just like to share. Ain't sharing. nothing wrong with sharing. And sharing is caring. This is delicious. And you wouldn't even think meat wasn't in him. Can you tell? I did a good job. Wow. Baby. This your first time having um, meatless lasagna? I'm going to tell you. I did it. I put the um, portobello mushrooms in there because portobellos really give you that. You got squash. You got zucchini. You got eggplant. I did sporadically the onions. Plant, no. The eggplant. The eggplant. Eggplant. No. Okay. The eggplant though. No. Mm-hmm. Eggplant. Marinara. Go for y'all. No, it's just not marinara. It's one thing mm. of jar marinara. It's tomato sauce and it's um tomato. Um, what is it? Petite cut up tomato. But it's fresh basil in here. Thyme. Salt and pepper. Garlic powder, onion powder, and the rosemary. And no, no rosemary. I did not use one dime of rosemary, baby. Surprise! And I love her. So you love rosemary, but I did not use her on this. This was a Italian dish. I about to use rosemary on my meat. Heard. That's a given. Rose to mirror my meat. You don't want rosemary. I'm the game. You just take okay? <laughs> <laughs> You don't want rosemary your meat. It sounded good at the time. Uh-uh. But, but <laughs> I knew what I was saying. I, I Not for her to get on it, but her for the marinade. <laughs> oh, man, cause we don't know. Marinade, she could just say something. It's a nanny here again. I'm trying to get rosemary off you. <laughs> oh, I thought it was a nanny here because I had a nanny here earlier. I mean, look at you. You pretty. Rosemary want to be on you. <laughs> Thank you. But you know what, y'all? This is what I'm going to do. We're going to do a glamorous night on y'all. A glamorous night mukbang. We're going to have a glamorous meal, and then we're going to be dressed up for that meal. What you think about that? Sound like a plan to me. It sound like a plan to you. You know I love getting dressed I up. I know you love getting dressed up, mm-hmm. but I'm fine. Fine and wine. I'm fine yes, and wine. I know. We're going to do a glamorous night. Glamorous night. I might have some hair down. I don't know what I'm going to do. So we're going we gonna to work on that. Then we're going to work on that meal. Mm-hmm. Hmm. I wonder. Me, you, glamorous night, small meal. Very small. There's my wheel. When you get done up, run up, get done up, run up. Run, I'm sorry, I had to get on moment. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Watch I me wheel. Put up and walk out. Me. Walk up. <laughs> run, up, <laughs> run up, get done up. I feel like me and you have a nice little social meal. Mm-hmm. And we give it to the fans. And we actually cook the meal before we actually get dressed. We cook the meal. We know what's going on with this small portion meal mm-hmm. to coat our stuff. Okay. Like we actually video. Me and you going doing the meal, going out now after the meal, oh, mm-hmm. going outside, going out and having fun together. I cannot cook mine. You know I eat like a tweet bird. Well, we'll eat a leaf for you, <laughs> and, then, <laughs> and we'll do one of these dishes for me. All right. Where's the me fairness you. of that? Me. <laughs> I'm so sorry if I eat a lot and stuff. You know, I got. I'm so sorry, Italy. Look how much I ate. I did good compared to what was on this plate, honey. I did. Look, look, look. Compared to what was on this plate, think about how I eat. I'm there. I know she healed. I know I'm trying, trying to talk about her, you know, but she's a macho for a snack. <laughs> <laughs> she was a macho snack eater. She cut up plate. I did time. real good. Look at that. I had a ham, a half a hamburger, and I ate. You ate the last bite of my burger. Come on now, this was really good she for me. A, she is a cilantro snack eater. I know. I know. 
I eat like a bird, y'all. So I you. promise y'all, I so do. I She's a rabbit. I do. She's I eat a, like a bird. She is a, I be rabbit. so hungry when I rabbit. when I'm hungry. I be so hungry. But then after I don't get had my bites, I'm done. Then once I drink, it's like over. So, back. I think that we and you. I'm not doing the whole Come meal. On. If I'm no, not no, doing no, no. we got a big meal. Okay. We do a small we'll meal. We'll do an appetizer. I'm just saying. Let's do an appetizer. We can, we can get g up. Okay, g nice up. And let them know how we do it. Okay. After that, we record ourselves out in the field, having a good time. Maybe a bar or a club here. Are you going to help me with here. that editing? We be in the show, ain't it? Well, let's have a show. Let's show how we get down. Get down downtown hey, Judy Brown. For all, that, all the old heads that y'all know downtown hey, Judy Brown. Hey, help me with that. Down downtown Judy Brown. He ain't gonna help me with that. Look how he tried to transcribe it. The editing is the part. It's the problem. Now we know. We know what. We are going to we the thirty and over bar. No, we're gonna have a good time. We're gonna finish. I'm sorry, it's going down. It's bad. You want content? You got. I'm editing. gonna give you content. Do you have editing? <laughs> Do you have editing? She wants content. I'm gonna I get want it editing too. We are going to the club. I'm bobbing head no man. I ain't going we to the club going, and video. We're going to the club. I ain't uh uh-uh, unless they pay me promotion. <laughs> I will. <laughs> I'll video like a mug if they pay promotion. Well, you, just, you just solve your own problem. Hmm. Yeah, I ain't solve mm-hmm. mine. You better get with that club on. And then you better get some extra battery. You didn't say nothing about a word. Okay. You gonna video some battery. I'm Rick James. You Rick James? <laughs> I ain't gonna go there <laughs> after that. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, Baby, this is lasagna. And you would have thought meat was in it, wasn't it? Mm-hmm. You did that. High five. Nope. Uh. I'm feeling something. Huh? No wonder. No wonder what it could be the 63 nine. Who? Because they knew you were making your lasagna. And so, what you said, you know what? Everybody make her lasagna. Let's go ahead and be out of the state. Six three nine. How no, we are not gonna do that. I'm not disrespecting yeah, the state. Hey. State. Hey, mm. you made some points. You did your thug fizzle cause you know y'all are not on the same as far as what they call it. Yes, I'm Alabama down state. state cause baby when A and them and state come here, baby, be all I'm down here, them. baby. I'm be all down, down, down here. If you don't know you on our day. If you ever want to come to Birmingham, the make party sure you in town come, come when on the Magic City Classic. Magic City Classic, baby. That's the we time. We put all this up and we put all this up. <laughs> we hey. put all this. Well, no, I still wear my house <laughs> kill two craps. But you I know. rep A and M. I'm an A and M fan. I'm sorry. I'm from Alabama State. Mm-hmm. And I had a couple of times with Alabama State, so I, I'm, I'm I love Alabama State. I'm, I'm A and M. We just gonna have to agree to disagree on that one. Hey, baby, he told that played up, child. Baby. He found Mary and Jesus on that plate. I found Mary and J. Black. Did you see? Okay, we did see the second part of um, Bobby. Bobby moving, and we talked about that last time, so I want to elaborate on this. No! <laughs> Do a whole tray over there. Uh, you yeah. okay? Don't. <laughs> you kidding me? It's heck. A whole tray? <laughs> I gave you a whole pan. You kidding me? <laughs> Don't do it again. <laughs> you can go fix another plate. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Well, one more time. No. Well, no. On, no. On the, on the edge. Cause you about to make me cry. No. <laughs> He's on camera. Okay, I'm gonna do it. I know you got it. <laughs> but you could have got another piece. <laughs> Your food made me cry. I'm so good. Because I build my sauce. <laughs> and he got a tear in his eye for real. <laughs> Tyler Perry. <laughs> Call him for a roll. <laughs> he can make a tear. He got one really, literally. <laughs> 
I'm done. Welcome to Cooking with E and Tilly. <laughs> Baby, they know that looks like a good one when they want to cry. Oh, oh my oh. Lord. Welcome to Cooking with E and T. Cooking with T and E. We out. We out. Hey, man.